Santa Cruz Island is the largest island in the Channel Islands National Park and Scorpion Rock is a relatively small islet just offshore from Scorpion Anchorage. Even though Scorpion Rock is very, very small, it, it has habitat for a, a lot of different seabird species. Even though it's really only an hour boat ride away from some of the most populous areas in California, it's critical habitat for a wide variety of species that you only find on islands. These offshore rocks on the islands here are, are havens for seabirds, but they're rugged and barren and you know, difficult to access and work on. But it's really important that we maintain them as habitat because they are the only places where these birds can nest in, in the California. Well, the main species um, that will benefit from the Scorpion Rock Project is the Castle's Auklet. It's a seabird that spends most of its life out at sea comes to these rocks and islands and it's important for the habitat to be here for them to come and have chicks and lay eggs. Beginning at least a couple hundred years ago we had we, we saw a very large increase in non-native vegetation uh, particularly on the islands. We're trying to restore scorpion rock to what we think it used to look like. We are trying to remove the non-natives and replace those with our, our native community structure. And they looked at historical photographs, they looked at um, journals from, from uh, botanists and naturalists who had traveled here, you know, even back into the 1800s. They looked at herbarium specimens, and so the, the plant palette was designed from all that information. We collected seed for a year. Just on the mainland side from the rock, we collected seed. It was on the mainland because there was none of those plants left on the rock. We sowed them inside the shade structure, grew them out in little flats, and then eventually into bigger pots and bigger pots. It's about a year to a year and a half process to get these plants ready to go into the ground. This is the extreme restoration. We should make a new TV channel. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>
that's going to ultimately benefit the auklets when they decide their time is right and they can nest here. For me, it's just incredibly rewarding to, to be doing something on the ground restoration to benefit these species that were just so incredibly impacted by humankind. I always say I'll come back for my 90th birthday and uh, point at the ind individual plants and know which ones I, I put in the grounds. We'll see.